What's up, everybody? So there's a new bill besides SOPA that we now have to worry about. It's called CISPA. And while uh, the Stop Online Piracy Act dealt with censoring sites that legally post the copyright content, CISPA and its design to help companies fight cybercrime potentially in exchange for helping the federal government on spy on users. It's a completely different issue than SOPA, says Jim Dempsey, Vice President for Public Safety Policy at the Center of uh, Democracy and Technology. This is about government monitoring. SOPA is about the First Amendment and CISPA is about the Fourth Amendment, but they both take a legitimate problem and try to tackle it with an overboard solution. CISPA's main goal, according to reps Mike Roger and Dutch Ruffersberger, is follows. Foreign government and independent hackers are stealing information from American corporations all the time costing the companies billions of dollars. The government knows how to stop these attacks and wants to help out private companies, but the current law doesn't allow them to share classified information in private companies. This book would open up that pop, pop, shit, pipeline, but it would be a way to street the way the bill is written. Companies can share users' information with the government, and if they sense a cyber threat, there we go. In a conference with the reporters Tuesday, Rogers and... Uh, Rupsaberg, or whatever the fuck his name is, said that companies wouldn't require to share information with the federal government. The government cannot require companies to give government emails and the type of information, and it is voluntary. Rupsaberg said that this is not a surveillance. Companies can give back the information and attacks and perhaps the threat of vulnerability of a system or a network, but only as it relates to a national security. So pretty much, this wants your Fourth Amendment, and SOFA wants your first. So, check out my next video, Arrogant Bastard Ale. I go know about SISPA. Please.